Hey, 517ers, welcome to the week two Sturdivant Report. And it's really good to watch these because they're real short, but they're going to make sure that you're on track, you're keeping pace, and they'll, they'll also answer some questions. You know, I, I love my green trees behind me. They're not going to be green for long. And as the class continues, we can watch these trees change beautiful colors. <laughs> Okay, Sunday night is a big moment for us. It's going to be our our second uh, team's conversation. This time we're going to talk about the concepts in week one. We're going to talk about ideas from chapter one. And we're also going to talk about our creation and then administration of a Quizlet live session. I've been very impressed from what I've I've heard from you on Voxer. I can't wait to go deeper. Also, Chapter 2, which we're going to start focusing on uh, next, is all about 21st century skills. And the good news for you guys, it's a pretty short chapter, but it has some pretty powerful ideas contained within. And here's something that uh, I feel so strongly about. It's really important to get kids' creative side out, to have them express themselves. But a lot of times, kids, when it comes to drawing something physically, start to shut down. You know, when they're young kids, they're willing to draw, but then they start comparing their drawings to everybody else, and they become real reluctant or real negative about the way they they create. And so this week, we're going to explore just a magnificent tool, which is called Google Drawings. Now, if you've done Google Drawings before, man, you are going to be on easy street. But I'm going to promise you that they're not hard to learn. And once you catch on, you're going to be like, dang, this is really cool. I can't draw, but I can create this awesome image. And you're going to want to do it, I predict, with your students. And no fears. If partway through the week you're lost and the tutorial I gave you just isn't doing it, you just send me a message and we'll get on Teams and we'll do a little screen share and I'll walk you right through the process and you'll be like, oh wow, oh yes, I can do it. And then I've been so impressed with how you guys have been boxing me. You keep that up. That's the way to get a hold of Sturdivant. And that is a wonderful way to keep in touch in a class that's all about technology. <laughs> we're, gonna, we're gonna be all about technology this semester. Hey, see you soon.